you may not even know that the Newport News Apprentice School has a football team, but they do. And this weekend, the builders will be playing for a national championship. Nathan Epstein joins us tonight with that story. Let's go! In its 99th season of football, the Apprentice School is playing in the postseason for the very first time. We expected to be here from day one. I know to some people that was sound crazy, but for us, this was kind of where we expected to be. What's crazier, after losing seasons in nine out of the last 10 years, the builders are one win away from a national championship. We set the expectation high early, and I think that's the biggest piece when you take over a new program. John Davis took over the program only six months ago. He's already built something special in year one. It changed the culture here. It gave us a positive attitude to win and want to win. And that's why we're in a position we're in today. It's one of those things that's going to take some time before it catches fire. But, you know, when we bring the trophy back, I think everybody in there will understand, okay, we got a, a formidable, formidable football program in year one. This might not be the football you're used to seeing. These guys don't play in front of 60,000 people. They have to work eight-hour jobs and then still show up to practice that same day. But they still have a chance to leave a championship legacy here in Newport News. It's kind of nice to go out knowing that we did something for the team instead of just being on it. Off the field, senior wideout Ethan Bryce from Pocosin is a welder, but through the ups and downs, he's never lost his love for life on the field. The past three years I've been here, a lot of people have, have quit and not come back pre, like the following years because of they kind of lose the love of the game. The people that stay are the ones that love the game. Senior Brandon Jones from Great Bridge High School in Chesapeake is the team's leading rusher, and he intends to leave a champion. This is my first one ever, so, you know, just want to be able to win and cherish that memory forever. It would mean everything to me to be able to give them that opportunity leaving out of here to be able to say they had one of the best football seasons ever in the history of a Prince school. The Builders will play Oakland University in Wheeling, West Virginia on Saturday. One win from the top. In Newport News, Nathan Epstein for the Sport Trap.